Ain't nothing but a peanut. These are actually fake weights right here. Lightweight. All right, hello my friends. Today we are doing Ed Cohen squat day because he doesn't have a specific leg day. If you guys don't know who Ed Cohen is, it is pretty much like one of the most prestigious powerlifters out there. I listened to a podcast, one of Tim Ferriss's podcasts with Steffi Cohen, which there's no relation. That's like C-O-H-E-N. Ed Cohen is E-D and then C-O-A-N. And I don't know, apparently in the powerlifting community, he is like known as the king of powerlifting. Like he is the one of the best of the best. And he just is known for having like just crazy training, like optimizing everything. So we are going to check out his squad today. I'm super excited. It's more my style. So let's go take some pre-workout and talk a little more about it. Okay. We got the pre-work guy going in the flash shaker cup. Grant's gonna meet me at the Y in like 30-ish minutes. So we're gonna sip on this, go to the Y. Uh, the workout seems to start out with seven sets of squats and it says two to seven, wait no, two to eight reps. And I looked a little more into it and what he does is a pyramid. So he goes, I think from what I saw, it's like around two sets of eight, two sets of five, and then, so I might do three sets of five and then two sets of two, because it said, it said two, two, two on one website. I couldn't find exactly, like exactly, exactly what it is, because obviously he probably changed it up from time to time. I'm just guessing everybody does that, so that just makes the most sense, but he only squats one time a week, which I find really interesting, because uh, when I started squatting one time a week, I started seeing like an increase in my squat as well, and I think it's just about recovery, really, because a lot of people aren't really recovering as much as they should be. So. I don't know, I'm excited, obviously. I'm excited for all these workouts because they're fun to do. This is gonna be by far my favorite one, I almost guarantee it. I'm gonna have to warm up a ton because I haven't went heavy in a while. I'm excited to see how much I can do, especially for like the sets of two. If I could get somewhere around like 455, it'd be pretty freaking sick. So I'm gonna drink this and then we're gonna get into it, baby. If I get 455, you guys need to, you guys need to give me to 1,000 subscribers, come on. That's like, that's like 100 more, it's not even that much, come on. For your boy, please. Hello, sexy car that needs a car wash. Oh, hello there. You boys better get out from underneath there. Dad's about to leave. Dad's about to leave. Dad's about to leave. All right, this man has been making me wait for like 30 minutes in the parking lot, but I forgot gum before I left, and then I remembered I put some in my center console, so. Life's all right. The entire time I'm warming up, literally all the way up until I get my knee sleeves on, honestly, even a little bit after that, my freaking hips are just crying the entire time. It's like, please, dear God, get this weight off me. All right, let's get into our first sets of eight here. We're starting our first set of squats. Like I said, we have seven sets, it's a pyramid, so we can pretty much do whatever I want. At least in our minds, that's what we're gonna do. So I think we're gonna do two sets of eight, three sets of five, and then two sets of two at the end. Or wait, no, three sets of two at the end, two sets of five, just because these past couple weeks we've been doing like extremely high volume and this is supposed to be a powerlifting workout. I wanna freaking lift heavy, so does Grant. So. First set of eight, uh, actually we had to change the weight because we didn't change his weight. So uh, I'm gonna do 365 though. I'm gonna go a little bit lighter than I normally would just because I actually wanna see how heavy I can get. I don't wanna like exhaust myself on these sets of eight really quick and then not be able to do much on the sets of five and two. So let's change the weight and get into it. Give, give daddy a kiss real quick. We just finished the sets of eight, which are obviously just absolutely terrible. Pretty sure I could do 135 for sets of eight, and I would still complain about it. Not gonna lie. Grant's starting his first set of five over here to 285. 285, let's go, baby. Moving up in weight, let's do it. My legs feel a little weak today, but still gonna go strong. I'm just thinking I'm gonna try 405. Let's do it. Good game, baby. So we did our sets of eight, our sets of five, and now we are on the sets of two. So I'm gonna do 425 for my first set and then see how that feels, kind of going from there. Uh, yeah, for the next two sets, hopefully just going up and up and up. Let's do it. actually felt really, really, really good. So 
hopefully we can go up from there. <laughs> First of all, if you guys uh, want a new song to listen to, Shit Show by Peter McPullen. It's like literally my favorite song right now. Been listening to it on repeat. He didn't like it that much, but bad taste in music. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> it feels really, really good to go ahead right now. I'm trying 435 for my second set of two, and then we're gonna try and go up from there, but it's being optimistic, I'm not gonna lie. I haven't went heavy in a long time. Grant's complaining, but it feels really good to be. I freaking love lifting heavy, as you guys know, if you followed me for a while, so. 435, let's do it. These are actually fake weights. Ain't nothing but a peanut. These are actually fake weights right here. Lightweight. He's not actually lifting this much. Good. Too easy. <laughs> it's actually gonna go up a little bit though. Let's do it. Alright, Ed, if you're watching this. <laughs> Who's the king of powerlifting? Who's the king of powerlifting? Natty. Natty powerlifting. Alright, 445. <laughs> we have like literally like eight sets of exercise left then we're done that felt really really good to go heavy I'm kind of excited to start powerlifting again soon I think I told you guys on Instagram and stuff I want to start powerlifting again soon I'm gonna start eating at maintenance and get just yeah more weight I don't know more weight going <laughs> I'm excited so I think we have single leg leg press next and then leg extensions and leg curls calf raises then we're done. Okay guys, so for foot positioning on this, honestly what I usually do is just set my feet up like I would normally be doing like a close grip or close feet width uh, to focus on your quads and then just take one foot off and then that's like what's good for one leg. We're doing two sets of 10 on this. Guys, my legs are getting hairy. I'm gonna have to start shaving them again soon. I'm sorry. <laughs> we need some definition. Alright, me and Grant are both recording our final clips here in our car. Say hello. Nice. Uh, yeah, so we just finished Ed Cohen's workout. That felt absolutely amazing. It's literally like the powerlifting that I want to get back into. I just love lifting heavy weight. It's fun. I will say, if you don't want to get injured, like if you're just a casual lifter, you don't need to go heavy. Like literally not even to get stronger or bigger whatsoever. Like you can do sets of eight to 12 and progressively get stronger doing higher reps. And then like, obviously that correlates to a little bit of lower reps too. But if you want to overall increase your one rep max, I do recommend diving into those lower rep ranges every once in a while. I mean, might as well switch it up, you know? But yeah, I honestly think that is the appeal to that type of lifting anyways, like powerlifting and whatnot, at least it is to me. It's like short, sweet, intense. And that's what I like. Like if I do more than three sets, realistically i'm gonna be like on the first and first and second set i'm probably gonna be thinking oh man i have five sets of this i'm gonna save myself till the like the fourth and fifth set because if i do go too hard now then i'm not gonna be able to go hard then like i don't know i psych myself out so if you're that same type of person maybe powerlifting's for you or maybe just doing fewer sets in general is for you anyways hope you guys liked the video <laughs> thank you guys for watching i appreciate it this one's probably a little bit shorter than the rest of them have been if you guys have any videos you guys would like to see comment down below I love you guys. Uh, today's Thursday. It's almost Friday. It's pretty close. Not gonna lie. Give me my weekly kiss. I only get it once a week. I need it. Come on. Drives me through the weekend. Love you guys. <laughs>